What's up, everyone? It's Tim from Tim Plays a Game. I uh, just got done watching the uh, Nintendo Treehouse uh, Live at E3 2016. Actually, it's still going to be going on all day. They're going to be showing more uh, Legend of Zelda, which has been uh, given the name Breath of the Wild for the Wii U. Uh, they're going to be showing that all day. I'm going to be watching it. <laughs> uh, so, basically, not a lot of information. Didn't expect them to do. I expected there to be some kind of surprise, but there wasn't. Uh... <laughs> But uh, from what I saw, though, I loved it. Uh, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, great title. Uh, they showed the opening shot of it uh, where you see, uh, I don't want to spoil too much, but uh, uh, basically set the, set the tone for the game where you will be exploring uh, the world around you. Uh, they really focused on exploration. I really like that. Uh, I like being able to jump with the X button. <laughs> Finally, they give us a button to jump with. Um, I really like the scenery. The graphics were amazing. Uh, in some of the game, some of the footage they showed you from, uh, you uh, you could see from the whole world from the top of a mountain. Uh, really like that. Um, I can tell why they they put so much focus on the game on this game. Nintendo really wants it to be a big money maker uh, when it comes out March seventeenth. No, March two thousand seventeenth. I'm sorry. Uh, they're trying really hard not to spoil the story. I really appreciate that. I don't want any spoilers until this game comes out. Uh, unfortunately, you know, me working on a YouTube on a, ma on a big YouTube page, I'm probably going to have to spoil it whenever I can. I'll put spoiler alerts in the title, don't worry. Uh, cool thing is the paraglider. I like the paraglider. You can, like, uh, get to the highest point and then just glide down to a certain area. It really helps exploration. Uh, there's no hearts or rupees in this game from what I've seen, so uh, if you need to recover health, you need to find apples or mushrooms to eat. Uh, there's no rupees, so, you know, I don't, I really doesn't, yeah, I mean, you don't have to, you don't have to worry about buying stuff. Kind of gives you more of a, more of an ex, a primitive uh, exploration type game. Uh, the map has so many cool features, I love it. I love that you have to, you can actually mark on your map where certain things are. Uh, you know, it's just, it seems like such a cool game and I really wish I could try it out, but I'm going to have to wait till next year to even, uh, even de do a demo of it. So, <laughs> um, other than that though, we had, uh, information about Pokemon Sun and Moon. Uh, the new, there were two new Pokemon revealed. I'm not sure if that was intentional or not, but, uh, one of them was Young, Youngus, Youngus, or, uh, yeah, like a Mongoose Pokemon. And then there was a uh, Picky Peck, which was a... Uh, woodpecker Pokemon. Uh, the new animations and the battle animation are awesome. I love it. Uh, and I'm very excited for one of the new features they announced called Battle Royale, which is basically a, a free-for-all of with uh, four players um, using Pokemon. And basically, I think it ends when uh, the first Pokemon gets or the first person without any Pokemon gets knocked out, so it's not a complete uh, single elimination. Um, let's see. Uh, there's a couple side notes. Uh, one, they uh, they did a moment of silence for uh, Orlando. I really appreciate that at the beginning of the treehouse. Uh, I live pretty close. I live about two hours away from Orlando, so that really meant a lot to me. Um, also, Reggie did call the new system the Nintendo NX. I'm not sure if anyone saw that, but they did put. Uh, I'm not sure if that's an official title, but if Reggie says it, I'm gonna say it is. <laughs> And uh, one more thing, yeah, they're uh, basically announcing on Nintendo eShop, you can uh, save up to 40% on select digital games, uh, Legend of Zelda, and Pokemon titles. Uh, my Nintendo members saving an extra 10% on the sale price of these select titles, so if you haven't registered for my Nintendo yet, definitely go ahead and do that. Um, other than that, though, I mean, that's it's pretty cut and dry right there. It wasn't, uh, wasn't a big... Uh, it, they uh, said going into E3 that they weren't going to be really revealing a lot. Uh, I have maybe two things circled on that bingo card that I tweeted earlier, and, uh, that's it. Uh, so, uh, not a big reveal for E3, but hey, I mean, Nintendo always reveals stuff at weird times, uh, throughout the year. You can definitely count on them doing that, um, later on, and, uh, I will be looking forward to any new information that comes out concerning Legend of Zelda, uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon, and Pokemon Go. So... For now, we'll just have to wait and see what the future holds. This is uh, Tim from Tim Plays a Game signing off, and good night.